Hey y'all, it's Lady C in the place to be. Lady C Lifestyles. All right, you guys, we are here for a big haul. Hubby came home today. We're still stocking up, y'all, okay? We're getting rid of Thanksgiving. We cleaned out the refrigerator. We put um, most of our leftover turkey, we put it in the freezer because we will be making soup. Um, our roast is gone. The four of us cleaned that out. The macaroni and cheese is gone. I think there are remnants of stuffing, but not enough to make a plate out of, you guys. Um, mostly everything is gone. The only thing we probably had left over was some sweet potato casserole, and it's very little of that, and some string beans, and it was very little of that. So we're moving on to the next thing. It's almost time for Christmas. So we're getting some of that together in this grocery haul, and just some of it is just things that we need around the house. So let's get into it. You know hubby had to go to the commissary. For those of you that are new here, that is the military grocery store. My husband doesn't work too far from there. He is retired Navy, so we do have those benefits. Um, usually you can get your meats for pretty cheap there, so we pick up our meats normally from there. Um, and then there are some other items that you can get for a great deal. So we pick up, uh, he picked up everything. All right, so we're going to get into our Monday haul and show you guys what we're getting into. First, you guys know what to do. Don't forget to like, comment, and if you have not, subscribe to the channel. I'll say it one more time. Uh, uh, let me get a church on, y'all. Subscribe, yes, to the channel, okay? Um, I would appreciate it. I, I surely would. Um, and if you would share me out with all your family, your friends, anyone that you know that would be interested in my type of channel. Now, my name is Lady C, and I am in the place to be, but uh, let me tell you about what I do, okay? Um, I like to shop. So you will get a lot of shopping hauls from me. Now, this is a grocery haul. It's also shopping because you got to shop for your groceries. But you will see me doing a lot of Dollar Tree hauls, a lot of discount stores like Ollie's and uh, maybe Aldi's sometimes, discount grocery stores. I like to look for the deals, okay? I may not always get them, but I do look for them. Um, I also like to do Ray Dunn. Now, I've been doing less Ray Dunn because Ray Dunn is kind of going up on their prices, you guys. Um, what I'm trying to do now is just pick up the pieces that I have to have with Ray Dunn. That's my philosophy. If it's something that I've got to have, I'll pick it up. Or if I find a piece of Ray Dunn that's at a discounted price, I'll pick that up. Um, Hubby and I also, we go to outlets. You know, we do anything we can to find a discount. But we do buy some full-priced items um, that you guys will see in our hauls also. So if you want to come along for the ride, hang out with us, just subscribe to the channel and you'll be notified anytime I come out with a new video. Now let's get into it y'all. All right. The first thing I'll be picked up was some bananas. Now he knows what to do you guys. He picked these up and they, see how they're sort of green. I like my bananas with that green on them. He does too. Um, you know, because this gives them time to ripen up. It also makes sure that they're not real, real soft. I don't like a real soft banana. Only time I want a real soft banana is if I'm making banana pudding or I'm making banana bread. So these are good. Um, he also picked up some, anybody, well, here's the shopper, baby. You want to say hey? Say hey to the people. What's up? What's up? <laughs> He's putting away bags, you guys, for me. Um, he also picked up, and let me fix this so you guys can see. Um, he also picked up some of these Dixie plates. Um, now, we do, we do not discriminate. We buy our plates from Dollar Tree. Um, we usually can't get the quantity that we want from Dollar Tree. You have to buy multiple. So, while he was in the exchange, uh, exchange, while he was in the commissary, he went ahead and picked up 48 of the Dixie. And usually the commissary prices are not that bad. So, we picked these up. Um, we also needed oils. My husband just fried chicken last night. Um, and we made fried fish the other day. So we needed some more oil. This is the Pompeian extra virgin olive oil. Smooth. All right. Sauteing and stir frying. I don't even think my husband saw that. I've never seen that on here, you guys. 
So they must have different ones. It says smooth on it. It's for sauteing and stir frying. Yeah, I saw that. I've never seen that. Okay. So anyway, we're going to use it for what we're going to use it. Um, but we picked that up. He also picked up a very large thing of vegetable oil. This is one gallon. And this is Freedom's Choice. This is the commissary brand. So he picked that up. That should last us for a little while. And he also picked up some of these. We love these Quaker Instant Grits. Now, my husband's from the South. He's from North Carolina. He does actually make the real grits, okay? But these are quick and easy when you're trying to run and go to work in the morning or you just want something to eat and you don't want to be stirring and messing around with the um, other grits. So these are the ones we pick up. Um, these are 10 packets. Yeah, this is 10 packets of the Quaker Instant Grits. Um, we also picked up, we ran out, or the one we had was just so old, you guys, and we ran out, the Domino's uh, Premium Pure Cane Light Brown Sugar. This is one pound. Pick that up because we'll be using this probably for the next holiday. Uh, me and my husband love oysters. Um, we will eat them out of the shell. We will eat them out of the can. It does not matter. These are the Chicken of the Sea Whole Oysters. And these are just says only the very best they're eight ounces and he also picked these up now these are my favorites i'm used to eating these these are the bumblebee hardwood smoked oysters oh and they come like in a box you guys these are really really good um these are 3.75 ounce i love these we had totally run out of oodles and noodles. I call them oodles and noodles. These are top ramen. Um, so help you pick these up. These are just the top ramen chicken. Sometimes we will make a meal out of these, you guys. If you don't know, you better know. We'll take these, um, make it up like a soup, cut up some shrimp, cut up some onion, put a hard-boiled egg in here. Oh, my goodness. You can set some ramen off. I love ramen soup. So he picked up a six-pack of these. Okay, this is the Oscar Mayer Fully Cooked Original Bacon. I like to have this um, for breakfast. These you can just microwave. They're already pre-cooked. Takes no time for you to cook these up and have them for your breakfast. Um, these are net weight 2.52 ounces, and it gives you 9 to 11 slices. You know, they may not be the best for you, but they are quick and easy in the morning. Well, we dropped that on the floor. Um, hubby might pick that up for you guys. Um, I picked, well, hubby picked up. Um, this is the black Hormel Black Label Applewood Thick Cut Bacon. Put it on top of it. Mm. Yeah. Um, Applewood Thick Cut Bacon. This is the real deal, y'all. This is the real bacon. Naturally hardwood smoked. This is 12 ounces. So he picked that up. Um, we were picking up some meats also. So this is, we like to keep a roast in the freezer. This is choice beef chuck mock tender roast. I don't know what that means, you guys, but it is beef and we picked it up. We will cook it till it falls apart. Yes, we will. Um, this is, let's see, 2.21 pounds and it costs us $8.84. That's not bad, so goodbye. Okay, then the next item, we haven't had this for a bit. Husband, hubby said he wanted some. He picked up some pork belly, some pork belly pieces. Um, these are 8.85 pounds, and they were $2.32 for a really big, pretty big pack. See these? These are pretty thick. Here's your pork belly. I told you he's from the South, y'all. Love some pork. <laughs> um, I didn't grow up eating a lot of these, you know, a lot of pork, but now that I'm married to my husband, yeah, I eat it a lot. Um, he also picked up these, both, both of us like these, these are the nation, mm, I cannot talk y'all, these are the Nathan's, um, jumbo restaurant style beef franks, that's what these look like, and let's see, there's some of the information on these for you guys, just says dinner size, keep refrigerated, fully cooked, once open to use within seven days. And these are used by January 21st, 2023. These will be gone by then. Um, we're going to stick with the meats. Hubby picked up some steaks. These are the Angus Strip Loin Steak New York Strip. 
Um, these are 0.94 pounds. These were $7.89. And you're getting two. They're little, but we I don't like a big old too fat of a steak. So that's what that is looking like, you guys. Nice, yummy, yummy. Like a good steak every now and again, so we like to keep these in the freezer. It's just the two of us at home. Um, so we usually like to keep two. So we if we want to eat, we have two steaks. Sometimes we will cut these up into strips. Um, you know, if you got company and you want to make it last, cut it up into strips and you'll have more for divide amongst more people. Um Okay, now we're moving on. Hope you got some ribs. I think he may be cooking these for the holiday, for Christmas. I'm not sure. Uh, we will be in North Carolina at his father's house. I don't know whether we'll be making these or not. These are the bone-in pork loin baby back ribs. My husband loves baby backs. I do too. Um, I love any rib as long as it's cooked good and tender and juicy and got good sauce on it, you know? Um... The total price was $8.11. Um, the weight was 3.27 pounds. So here is your rib, baby back, baby back. Put that to the side. And then we're going to get down to the family pack. Yes, you guys, the family pack of the chicken drumsticks. Um, these had less than 5% retained water. And these, oh yeah, we got a good price on these, you guys. Price per pound, 0.75. The net weight is 4.63. And the price was $3.47. Chicken is your best bet. And when we pick it up from the commissary, they always have good prices on their meats, as I told you guys. Um, I don't know what the government does, but the meats, hey, I can I can get with the meat, the meat prices. So we always go usually to the commissary to pick up our meats, unless we see a sale at another grocery store um for a better price than what they have okay so that is all the meats um we also like to get these little side salads to have when we're you know on days when we don't want to cook um this is the chicken queso fresco i really like this hubby got this for me the last time i had only tried it once it was really good it comes with a creamy avocado dressing oh it is good you guys um let me show you and it comes with everything. There's your lettuce, your dressing. Um, let me show you. And then there's like the veggies, the corn and everything. I think it comes with corn and black beans. This is a really good salad if you haven't tried um, by Bistro. This chicken queso fresco, really good. Um, hubby likes, well, he likes anything Asian. He usually gets a chef salad, so they must not have had them. Um, this is the Bistro Chopped Asian Style Salad with Sesame Ginger Miso Dressing. Ooh, that sounds good, you guys. And that's what that looks like. It even gives you the fork. You see the fork there? But that's what that looks like. Looks, looks like it has some nuts in it and everything. Okay. Then on to the veggies. Um, we usually pick up broccoli. That's one of our favorite, favorite, favorite veggies. We got the Green Giant Simply Steamed, the broccoli florets. Love them. We do do fresh broccoli, too, but... You know, just didn't pick them up. Um, now, I know these are for Carolina. Their favorite veggie at my husband's home is okra. I mean, every time I go there, we had okra. His parents used to grow okra in their farm. Uh, I mean, in their garden, they always had okra. Oh, my God. And okra, fresh okra from the garden, you guys don't even know. But anyway, um, so we buy it frozen. Um, his dad does get some packs for us fresh from other people's gardens because um, his father doesn't grow it anymore. Um, but this is fresh frozen. This is Pick Sweet Farms cut okra. And you get a whole large bag, you guys. And it's really cheap. I'll have to give you the pricing on it. Um, this is 28 ounces, one pound, 12 ounces. I'll put the pricing at the end of the video, you guys, because this we usually get these veggies for a good price. Now, he will, my husband will usually cook up. These are the Pick Sweet Farms baby llamas. Now, he will normally cook the beans. Let these cook up with your fat meat and your seasoning. Yummy, yummy. Then he will put the okras on last. Put them on top. And basically kind of let them steam. Oh, that's a meal, y'all. That's a meal. So, you can do that with the baby llamas. He bought two packs of the okra. Or you can do it with the field peas with the snaps. If you have never had field peas with snaps, go and get you some. 
go and get you some y'all because these are really 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 good okay i grew up in delaware never had field peas never had field peas with snaps ever in my life had never heard of them um married my husband and got these the field peas there's the snaps man these are so good and tasty this bag is uh, oh here it is you guys i'm sorry one pound 12 ounces so he'll do the same with these he'll cook these up and then we'll put the okras on top man something good something good y'all um we got a bag of potato and we picked up some more forks because i love having plastic forks i don't like washing up silverware if i don't have to um i told you guys about every let me make sure everything else so that's about everything oh he did pick up my favorite water this is evermore we love this water um, we picked up a four count of this. I will put the price in there, you guys, because um, I can't remember what the pricing is, but it's pretty good on these. Um, and he picked up another thing of eggs. My family, we are egg lovers, so these go fast. He loves Eglin's best. They're not the cheapest, but they're, they are the best. I mean, these are some really good eggs, you guys. 12 eggs. These are the extra large. I will put the pricing out there so you guys can see because we usually get, I mean, it's not too bad of a price, and these are really good eggs. Um, so that's it, you guys. That's all we picked up for the Monday grocery haul. I hope you guys are starting your week out okay. Um, I know we had to go back to work, some of us. Some of us may still be off. But uh, for those of you that had to go back to work, I hope you, you, know, you made it through the day. We made it through the day. It's 536 here, so we made it, you guys. We made it. Just hang on in there. Lady C loves you. Um, I give you big hugs. But anyway, I have got to go. Love you guys. Stay stay safe. Ah, man, you guys, I can't talk today. Stay safe, you guys, and stay blessed. Lady C is out. I'll always be back with another video. Talk to y'all later now. Bye-bye.